what is going on everybody this is your boy red the host of the rh3 show man this video right here is going to be a stew of topics surrounding one individual yes fantasia this is her um her date of her album release um i say she had a comeback interview with the di with robin roberts this morning on good morning america she performed bittersweet um is some news about Oprah and Monique one and Paula on their show and I'm also gonna do a mini um a mini review of her bittersweet video so please stay tuned man I'm telling you this is one episode you don't want to miss so in the meantime we're gonna roll the credits and I'll be talking to y'all soon this is the RH3 show What's going on everybody? Like I said at the beginning of the credits, um this video is 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 gonna be a stew uh, a stew of topics uh, pertaining to Fantasia. Yes, um this morning, August the twenty fourth, she did an interview with um, that with I don't know why I keep saying dying sorry with Robin Roberts on Good Morning America and I'm telling you I, I I can still feel that um she's in pain I can still I felt the vibe I promise you I don't know if it about anybody else but I still feel the hurt and you know what she's going through she I don't think she's over it I really don't think she's over it but um according to the interview um she stated that she knew exactly what she was doing and when she woke up she was like oh lord i'm still here but she wanted to get away from the pain and she said she'd been in pain and she'd been hurting ever since 2006 but you know when the start of idol the mess that she went on with idol and you know around her her release of her autobiography uh life is not a fairy tale the book the movie um her sin on you know broadway and all of that she said she's been hurt and she wanted all the pain and everything to just cease but um she said she knew what she was doing when she took the the, the bottle of pills but um yeah fantasia girl man she, she she also said she wanted somebody to listen to her which was her life coach um you know the one that you know just she needed somebody to talk to and her life coach was the one that treated her like, um, you know, somebody. Her and another nurse, she said, at the hospital treated her as Tasia. And um, that's what she wanted. That's what she, that's what she all she wanted was somebody to treat her like, you know, treat her like somebody. And um, she didn't get that. But um, she, I, I feel that she's still hurting. I really do. I feel that. Um, Fantasia is not at the point that where she want to be and this morning this morning I was on Facebook and I seen somebody else post on their status or I think it was under a video I don't know it was somewhere on Facebook on their profile that they said that she she just she needs to be doing gospel and I promise you that is the third time I've heard that so Fantasia Fantasia management, Fantasia crew, if y'all watching this, she, please steer her in that way. Let her know that her fans want her to do the gospel and have a discernment and know that they feel that this is not the right place that she needs to be. And she's not going to prosper. She's not going to be happy. She's not going to feel free unless she goes to that direction. Um, I first heard that with um, Tasha over at at um her channel tasha tv youtube.com forward slash big tasha you can check her out but anyway i heard i seen her tweeting that you know she felt feel that fantasia need to be doing gospel and she do she really do and with that performance her bittersweet performance man she did it again she did it again you can tell i i just felt the vibe i don't know i think that's a gift I can feel vibes, I can, you know, read people good, and that's a discernment, I mean, you know, I, I just felt in my spirit, I felt in, I felt that she, she was hurting, she's still hurting, and I felt that, um, it, it was just a 
it was just a cloud over her to, to me, and I felt that that Fantasia, you know, she's not at the place that she 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 needs to be. She's not at her place. Even if her life coach did tell her that uh, it's okay for her to get back to work, I feel that you know Fantasia. She she needs to rest for one, and she also needs to change her um her. But job. yeah, Fantasia, man, girl, I'm telling you. I'm praying for you, sweetheart. I am so praying for you, and I think, you know, I thank God that you're here. And you know, please, please stick it out for your daughter. Please stick it out for your daughter. All right. Next topic is going to be about Oprah and Monique and Paula on the on their show. For what? To get into the business. I mean, Monique and Paula. Y'all, excuse me, Monique and Oprah. That move. Is nothing but a gossip move. Um, that's just like TMZ or whatever, or media takeout, or um, any other gossip show. You know, wanting to get up in the business. You just trying to stir, stir trouble. Let it be. Let it be, y'all. Especially Oprah. You too classy for this. And I'm telling you, if it happened, I really gonna lose much respect for you because. I already lost respect whenever you whenever you say why why should God be jealous of you, but um when you when if this happened then it's going to be another notch down the respect um down the respect meter because just let it go just let it go let her deal with it and it's too much that's going on with Paula and Fantasia and Antoine and with putting them in it is going to also put the children in it so. They are too far in this now. Oprah and, and, and Monique, don't do it. I mean, please don't. Um, and last and finally is Fantasia's um, music video, Bittersweet. Um, I just now watch, I just watched it today. And I, to be honest with you, I don't even know when it came out. So I, I, if it came out, you know, about a few months ago, a month or so ago, I'm late. Forgive me. But, um, yeah, Fantasia, that video, I really do, I, I, I like the video, I did, I really did. I'm going to be honest with you, I was in that type of situation, you singing in this song, um, when we were together, you didn't treat me right, yes, I really loved you, I ain't going to lie, when I think about you, it's just bittersweet, but, you know, with me, I don't even, when I think about the child, I, I I cringe and want to throw up, but um, um, you know we just we good friends now. But anyway, I really enjoyed that video. The the synopsis of it, the you know the acting or whatever. I don't. It, it was okay. It was good. I I really I I liked it. I really did. It was classy. I I really did. The sexual part of it whenever you were you know on him while he was sitting on the couch you could have been dreaming I don't know if that was okay I don't know if that went well with the video but overall everything else um I I, I enjoyed it alright but um, in the meantime you guys have a blessed and wonderful day and I'm glad to uh, be giving y'all this video I so much uh, I, I so much enjoy this Fantasia um you make my hobby. You artists, the television shows, the music, um, the reality shows make my hobby. Make me enjoy it. I really do love doing what I'm doing on here on YouTube. And I thank y'all subscribers for sticking with me, for riding with me. Continue to support. Continue to thumbs up the video. Continue to share it. Um, you know, if you're not a subscriber, please click the subscribe button right here at the top, at the very top, it says subscribe. If you're not a subscriber, subscribe to my video and check out the hundred and something video. In the meantime, you guys have a blessed and wonderful day. Check me out on Facebook. Check me out on YouTube here. Of course, you check me out on YouTube. But if not, if somebody's sharing this video, go to youtube.com forward slash I rep a savior. I R E P A S A V I O R. And also go to um, twitter.com forward slash the RH3, the number three project. That's T H E R H, the number three 
project P R O J E C T and you know we we in for it. I am not fully back, but um I'll be back, you know, within a week or so and there's you know, anything you want me to go. review. Is there anything you want me to test out, try out, whatever? Email me rh 3 show at gmail dot com and I'll check everything out. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, any dilemmas you're going through and you need my advice, email me at ask rh three ask rh three at gmail dot com. I'll be seeing y'all on the next video and this is your boy Red and you are watching and you are tuning in to the RH3 show.